everybody. How are you today? Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening to you all. <laughs> well, I'm going to go for a flip cut with some crazy weird colors I picked out, so... <laughs> Can't promise anything, but I like these colors, and I think they might go together. I don't know about the burnt sienna, but, eh, give it a try. Let's see, I've got an 8x10. Went ahead and sprayed down my canvas with a little water. As tight as a drum. And we'll begin. Let's see. What do I have here? I finally got me a couple tubes of Artist Loft. And this is Yellow Orchid. That's a pretty cool color. Don't look yellow, but it's like a brown tan. Actually, like a tan. Then I splurged on another one, Naples Yellow. And then another one which is called Aqua Green. And this one, I'm afraid to put it in there because I might be doing wrong, but Burnt Sienna. <laughs> I just thought these colors might go well together. We'll see. And I'm doing a flip cup, so who knows, you know? All right, let me see which order do I want to do this in. I know I'm going to do black first. And what do I want on the top as my favorite color? I would say this aqua. And then I will go in this order then. This is what I'm going to do. Because we got your black, your dark, black, okay? Then the lighter. So it's not dark on dark, right? Then this next color is lighter, or a little darker. And then this would be, of course, your darkest besides black. But I'm going to put that in the middle. Because I want this to be more on my top. But it don't always work out that way when you're doing a flip cup. I'm not pouring on the side of my cup this morning. So, yeah, go for the best here. And I want to do about three ounces. So three ounces in this cup would probably be about right there. Oh my goodness, I forgot to put gloves on. Need my gloves. I don't want to sit and scrub my nails afterwards. It's a bummer. You have to get your nail brush out. And... I don't feel like doing that. I just did last night. Well, my fingers get pretty dry in my hands do my cuticles from scrubbing them so much and from the dry paint. Paint dries them out for some reason. Hopefully you can see well. It's the morning and I have my curtains up in there. And I'm not using any silicone. I'm using one part paint. Or I'm using the th three parts Floetrol. And one part paint and about one part water because we've got oh, I, hope I didn't put too much of that in man what was I saying we have thicker paint this is much thicker because it's it's better paint than the Craftsmart. So 
of course I have to ups my flow troll and I did that to three a little bit more of each just a little bit I'm gonna skip the bur the umber well because I think I put a lot of that in there so I'm not gonna I'm gonna skip that color okay I'm not gonna stir that any I'm just gonna flip that little thing over Ooh. and give that a few minutes for that black to drain down just about a minute you really should wait longer than that I personally hmm I forgot what they say cuz you know your black has to drip down and you want that black I would probably say maybe about two minutes max but of course I'm gonna only go one minute here I'm gonna feel flicks there Well, my dad used to be good at that. He could do it hard. And I mean really hard. And he would do it against my belly just to play around. And it would actually really hurt. That's a strong little flick we have there. Okay. Okay. Don't want that going over. Get my tips. Try to get those areas right there. Not necessary, but whoa! Look at the see the cells in that baby popping up. Crazy. Well, they say the better paint you got, the better chance you have at cells. So I'm putting this underneath here just a little to because I'm not level. The table obviously is not level again. I think all the black came over on this side. I always say here goes nothing <laughs> and I hope not <laughs> I hope here goes something <laughs> very dry guess so board there are all these canvases are coated with it's called gesso Tilt it to bring it over there. It sure is looking pretty. Beautiful. Nice paint. Lots of black ended up there. So, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to go this end first. 
because I'm probably going to want to drop drip off a lot more of that black, I think. Man, I've got to turn my air off again. What's the deal with that? Well, it is getting hotter today. I put too much black, obviously. center it to the middle. And that is an awesome hookup. That's some big cells. I feel like I want to tip that off. Hmm. But it's pretty. The next one I do, I'm going to keep that burnt umber off. Or burnt sienna, it's called, right? I don't know, should I keep that there? Because uh, we have all of our colors. So, yeah, we don't need that deep. So I'm going to just work it slowly back there. And just kind of drain a little bit more off. There we go. Much cooler. So very awesome paints. I can tell that these are definitely full of pigments. That's a crazy looking one. Um, not sure it's that cool, but think it is. It's actually pretty cool. I don't know what happened, but I must have got because <clears throat> this has a starter on it and must have gotten paint in there. Because it wouldn't start for a couple days. Well, actually, it was like a week or two, so it actually needed to dry out really big time. Pretty crazy looking. Not bad. It's some awesome paint. Definitely awesome paint. So, just some huge, huge cells. Uh, it's just sort of like, I um, wonder if it's focusing without the light. See it, you guys. So it's pretty. Let's see, I would probably have it that way. Different. That is for sure. And Hopefully, you can see, let me turn on this light because I'm testing things. That way I'll see the difference when I watch the video. Sure is pretty. That burnt sienna in there.
definitely awesome looking. All right. Well, guys, have a good day. Make sure that you do it some things that make you feel good. Don't do anything you don't want to do unless you have to work. <laughs> have a good positive day, and I'll talk to you later. Go ahead and like and subscribe. And if you like this video, let me know. Make, leave a comment. Let me know. Bye.